Glenn, you have a popular Facebook live show called Rise and Grind. Can you tell us about that and why you started that morning show? Yeah, man, absolutely. So hashtag Rise and Grind. I go live Monday through Friday morning, 5.30 a.m. with motivation, education, and inspiration. And ultimately, that show came from three key components. Uh, the first was I wanted to help people change the way they start their day. I'm just such a huge fan of a powerful morning routine. I know what it can do in people's lives. And so I wanted to be an account accountability piece. I wanted to be a piece where people could come and they would know, hey, Glenn's going to be there. He's going to rise with me and I could help push people and educate people on the power of a good solid morning routine. Another reason that I wanted to put together Rising Grind is from a branding aspect for our dealership. It was really incredible to be able to go live every single day. And I would say, hey, my name is Glenn Lundy. I'm a husband to one, a father to, back then it was like five. Now I have seven going on eight, right? But a husband to one, a father to five, and the general manager of Dan Cummins, Chevrolet and Buick in Paris, Kentucky, the second largest used car franchise dealership <laughs> in America. It's 5.30 a.m. And I hope you're ready to rise and grind. So mm -hmm. saying that every single day was creating a branding element as well. And yes. I would tell stories about our dealership and the people of our dealership mm -hmm. and the impact we were making in the community. And so it was just, a, it was really great for branding. It mm -hmm. was really great for helping people change the way they start their day. Mm -hmm. And then the third key and most important component is I wanted to create a space that people could come to and feel seen. Yes. So on every single show, when people are on, I say, good morning. I spend 30 minutes after the show going back, responding to everybody's comments so that they can just feel seen because I know what it's like to be completely invisible and it's miserable. And so I hope that with the show, by being consistent with it, we've done 758 episodes now, by being consistent with it, I hope that if there's ever someone out there that feels alone or feels they don't have worth or they don't have value, if they could just hold on till 5.30 a.m. that next day, mm -hmm. they're gonna know Glenn's gonna be there, a whole tribe of other people are gonna be there, we're gonna say good morning, we're gonna high five, we're gonna lift each other up, we're gonna encourage each other, and hopefully that can shift where they're at mentally, at least in that moment, to help them get through that very next day. So those are the three main reasons we do the show. Um, you know, really change the way people start their day. We do, it's effective for marketing and branding. And then it also creates that space for that one individual yeah. that just needs to hear somebody say their name. Yeah. And that's part of also my show that I am giving back to the community because I feel that I was given a lot. Now I'm giving back. And sometimes it's difficult to handle all this technical or getting all the interviews. But when I hear someone saying that that was a great tip or thank you for doing this, it motivates me to continue and doing it. Yes, man, absolutely. And, and I think I, and I know that you have now merchandise about Rise and Grind, right? <laughs> <laughs> we do, man. It's expanded. It started as just a a show at, at 5 30 in the morning and then the people watching the show wanted a group so we created a group that now has over 30,000 members in it on wow. Facebook um, that's nothing but motivation education inspiration we have over 50 monitors that keep the group clean of any politics or division or any of that mm -hmm. stuff and then uh, from there people wanted t-shirts and so we started doing t-shirts and now we have t-shirts and hats and We just got this camo hat, which is amazing. I'm loving it, right? So we've got t-shirts and hats and planners and all kinds of stuff. And it's really evolved into something special. Those are great. Thank you for sharing your morning show. And I will I now put the link of the Rise and Green website so people can buy some of the merchandise. And right. for the audience watching and listening, tune in tomorrow for another great question with Ken.